Hello friends, Note 8 retails for almost $1000. What is the big thing all about? The short answer is Note 8 is the best phone available today. There are two types of high-end spec phones. The first type are high spec phones with little compromise on perfection. The second type are the high spec phones with perfection in every spec. Note 8 belongs to the second category. For example, both OnePlus 5 and Note 8 have dual camera and they both can take great shots. But OnePlus 5 does not have optical image stabilization and Note 8 is the world's first phone with dual optical image stabilization. The problem is the perfection does come with a premium cost. Note 8 is just a bit longer than S8 Plus with squared edges. This has 6.3 inches display with 83.2% screen to body ratio. The ratio is slightly less than 84% of S8 Plus. The fingerprint sensor is still at the same spot and it is difficult to reach than S8 Plus as this phone is little longer. The squared edges does bother reaching the fingerprint scanner a bit more than S8 Plus which has rounded edges. The border around the fingerprint scanner has a depth unlike S8 Plus for easy identification. This phone is IP68 certified. On the left there is a volume rocker and Bixby button. On the right there is power button. On the top there is SIM card tray and noise cancelling mic. On the bottom there is a 3.5mm jack, Type-C port, speaker grill and S Pen. On the back, there is dual 12 megapixel with 2x optical zoom and S health sensor. The front selfie camera is 8 megapixel with autofocus. This either comes with Exynos 8895 or Snapdragon 835 variant with 64 GB storage and 6 GB RAM. The SD card slot can support up to 256 GB storage. This has Bluetooth 5.0 which can stream at the same time to multiple Bluetooth devices. This has quick charge 2.0 and supports wireless charging as well. The battery is the major letdown in Note 8. This only has 3300 mAh battery which is less than S8 Plus with 3500 mAh battery. With bigger screen and smaller battery this will last a bit less than S8 Plus. The biggest advantage of Note series over the premium S series is the S Pen. There are two new features when compared to previous Note versions, Live Message and Translate. Live message is basically a graphical content which can be shared with the same graphics to others. Translate option translates content to desired language as and when highlighted with S Pen. Apart from that, all other options are pretty much available in the edge screen option itself which is common for Note series and S series. The best feature about Note 8 is its dual 12 megapixel camera with 2x optical zoom. The live focus option lets user to select focus like an SLR camera. This basically takes two photo, one in short range, another in long range and adjusts the blur effect even after taking shot. With sample recording, the photo and video quality are by far the best I have seen in any smartphone till date. The only disadvantage is that live focus will work only with excellent lighting condition and not in indoor lighting. If you are a Note fan who likes dual camera and have heavy dependency on S Pen, then Note 8 is for you. Else, S8 Plus is better option which has similar spec and it is lot cheaper than Note 8. Dear friends, please click on thumbs up if you like this video. Please subscribe to support this channel and to stay tuned with the real tech reviews.